Hello, Windows enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the world of networking on Windows 11 and 10. Specifically, we'll be exploring IPv6 and showing you four different methods to disable it. Whether you're troubleshooting connectivity issues or just want to streamline your network settings, we've got you covered. But before we jump in, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay updated with our latest tech tutorials. Now, let's get started. Our first method involves using the network and sharing center. This is a straightforward approach for those who prefer a graphical user interface. Click on Change Adapter Options in the Advanced Network Settings to access the network adapters. You can also access the network adapters by pressing the Windows key and the letter I. Click on Network and Internet Settings. You can also access the adapters from the control panel. Right-click on the network adapter you want to configure and select Properties. In the Networking tab, scroll down the list, uncheck the Internet Protocol version 6, and click OK. And there you have it. IPv6 is now disabled for this network connection. Let's move on to the second method. For those who prefer command line interfaces, our second method involves using the command prompt. This method provides a quick and efficient way to disable IPv6. Search for the command prompt on the start menu and open it with administrative privileges. Run the following command. This command disables Torito, a protocol that allows communication over IPv6 even when the network is using IPv4. Next run this command. This command turns off the 6 to 4 functionality, another method for transmitting IPv6 packets over an IPv4 network. Please execute the following command to disable the intrasite automatic tunnel addressing protocol. This protocol facilitates the connection of IPv6 hosts or networks over an IPv4 network. After running this command, please restart your computer to ensure that the changes take effect. And just like that, IPv6 is disabled using the command prompt. Let's move on to method number 3. We are now going to use PowerShell to disable IP version 6. Run the following command to get the names of all the network adapters with IPv6 enabled. To disable IPv6 on a specific network adapter, run this command while replacing net adapter name with the actual network adapter name you got with the first command. To disable IPv6 on all network adapters, run the following command. Once done, restart your computer. That concludes our tutorial on disabling IPv6 on Windows 11 and 10. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and share it with your fellow Windows enthusiasts. If you have any questions or if there's a specific topic you'd like us to cover in the future, let us know in the comments below. Until next time, happy networking!